It is 6.45. I got my first order. It is for eight dollars. There are those golden arches. We have secured the package. Alright, I got that one dropped off. Four items, fourteen dollars. It's less than a mile of driving. While I was doing the Instacart, I got an Uber for 12 bucks going four or five miles. So now I'm gonna go pick up this Duncan. Then we're gonna go drop off the Instacart. Then we're gonna figure out where the Duncan goes. Have secured the Duncan. Dropped off that Instacart. Now I gotta make a mad dash to figure out where this Duncan is going and get it to this person. We dropped that one off. Instacart, it was like $17. It says it's going three miles, but that'll probably end up being more like six miles. <coughs> six miles? If I don't pick up a food order. Got that Instacart order in the car. Somebody's coming. Nope, my car's just tripping out. Oh, DoorDash is ringing. I actually hope it's not a good order. Damn, I gotta take that. I forgot y'all was there. But yeah, this DoorDash. I'm gonna take it a roundabout ass way, but I'm gonna drop off this Instacart, drop off the DoorDash. Went down just like I told y'all. I shopped for the food. Then I secured the McDonald's, which is going like half a mile away from my house. So I go drop off the Instacart, go drop off the food. Bada bing, bada boom. It'll be good $25, maybe in an hour, maybe 45 minutes. Oh, I just dropped that Instacart off. I need to get my, my head cam so when it's leaving my door, I can get some POV. This is really just a trial run today. But going to drop off this Mickey D's that goes right next to my house. It was $17.30 for that Instacart. It, took, it was five miles to pick up and drop off. And I would normally be driving back to my house. But because I got this McDonald's going back towards my house, these is free miles. This thing's paying me $6.50 for a drive I was already going to do. And when I walked into McDonald's, he was putting them stickers on that bag, man. Oh, Uber's trying to give me a ripoff. Let's see what that is. 967 for 4.4 miles. Wow. But it leaves me in Crofton. $17 Instacart and an eight dollar and fifty cent DoorDash. And when you look at the time, it took me 40 minutes and I drove 7.1 miles and I got gas. I just got this Instacart that's a banger. 18 items, $29, going like three miles. Um, yeah, so I accepted the Instacart order and then I live so close to the grocery store that I accidentally started shopping already. So, you know, I'm trying to keep my time per item down. Alright, just dropped that Instacart off. Weird shit. It said don't knock on the door. Anyway, there was two dead geese just like chilling at their front door. I just figured they hunt or something, I, I don't know. At first I was like, do they know they have dead geese? And then I'm like, I, I'm I'm just gonna move on with my day. They tipped me $20. You know, like the geese look like they had broken neck. $3.70 for 6.7 miles, hell yeah, Uber. So I got, it's only, I think 
it was like 14.38. Something like that. But it's only four items. It's going like two miles. So I'm already at the grocery store essentially. So four miles total. All right, the order has been secured. Made it to the store. Shop for the order. Driving away, 10 minutes. off I got a DoorDash shop and pay for the Safeway six items it's going six miles fifteen dollars and seventy five cents so I got to do that and then I think I'm taking a break because it's almost it's almost noon and I've made like 120 bucks <clears throat> it's pretty good All right. secured the order I think it took less than 10 minutes to pick up that stuff. They just wanted some sandwiches, some whipping cream, and some water. So, I got myself a little bit of chili. Because that's what I need for my bike ride. I need some, some protein and some carbs. Keep me fueled up. Alright. I made $15.75. Not bad. This was kind of in a weird area, but it was really close to the Safeway, so can't complain. Now I gotta hurry back and eat some chili and ride my bike. And now I just got a Instacart for like 14 bucks. It's seven items. Chips, soda, tomato, lettuce, like this is gonna be an easy, easy order. It was going less than a mile. Maybe it was a mile. I th I'm pretty sure it said 0.8 from the grocery store, and I'm like 0.5, so it ain't going far. And we're gonna make some money. light on here so we popped off of uber eats it is 4.4 miles it was eleven dollars and seventy cents i debated it and then i remembered eleven dollars is where they hide tips on uber eats so let's see if i get that bag oh they stacking it but are they adding two deliveries for ten dollars here or is this just adding bentos they took it away i didn't get it oh i'm an idiot wow well we'll never know okay look at this one now so they were trying to get me to do two more orders for another ten dollars to do a total of three orders because this one 362 for <laughs> come on uber get it get out of here tell that person to go get their own ice cream if they don't want a tip. That's all I gotta say. Go get your own ice cream if you don't want a tip. Alright, now super lucky. I picked up, I've only picked up at that place a couple times. And before, I always had to wait. But they had it sitting right there, ready to go. Um, this order is going, I should have known this when I accepted it. Because I know the address. It's going to this apartment building that is really annoying because it's like a freaking maze to figure out where you need to go
bags have been secured. Chipotle was slammed. And I just got this Uber that was $16 for two miles. But it's a Baskin Robbins. And Baskin Robbins don't never have the stuff, but it's right by my house, so I'm gonna try it out. Alright, so I drove to the Dunkin' Donuts and then I looked at the Uber app and the person canceled the order. So that's uh, no bueno there. Back in the office, secured the bag. Back in the office. That one felt like bonus pay, but it wasn't. Just the regular pay. All right, y'all. <coughs> I think this is gonna be the last order for the night and for the week. It's 12:75. It's going like six miles, which kind of sucks because you know like it's going six miles and really there's not <coughs> much food in the direction it's going so I'm pretty much gonna be eating the miles getting one dollar per mile but it's gonna put me at like a hundred and ninety five dollars for the week for the week oh god that would be terrible no for the day so I'm gonna take it and then that's gonna be it maybe if I can find another one Coming home, if that can happen, I'll do it. But we'll see. All right, this is the outro. I had to drop that order because they hadn't even started it, and they were saying it'd be like 15 minutes for it to be ready. And uh, nope, I'm just not interested in doing that because you know it was six miles away, and if I gotta wait 15 minutes, and it's gonna take me 15 minutes to go drop it off, I'll be 45 minutes into making 12 bucks. It's not the worst thing, but I'm not interested in doing that. Uh, I think I'm done for the week. Good day.